Weinstein. That is the current name for the song. I'm, I'm not sure because it does have problematic similarities with Weinstein. It is about something that gets into the fabric of your being and just stays there, you know, like a stain. And particularly, this is about being affected by addiction, alcoholism, with someone that you care about, suffering and dealing with that and how it affects the people around them and uh, the people who love them. When we go under anesthesia, if you have a surgery or something, you don't remember it at all. And so it's not part of your life. You don't remember the pain. It doesn't really affect you because it's not something that lodged itself into your experience. Now there are, of course, things that you could go into, studies they could do about if it affects you subconsciously, perhaps it does, but it's not part of your consciousness. It doesn't affect how you feel about things because it's not part of your life. The sad part about something like drinking too much is that you miss out on things, you black out. So if you care about someone who is losing parts of their life, those things could include you, and then it definitely affects your relationship, how they feel about you, vice versa, and it can leave people really affected, and it can take a long time, which is why I say a stain. A stain isn't sweet like the wine. It doesn't get better with time. And then at the end, I say, and you know what they say about time? It's a lie, meaning people say that it heals all things. Maybe it's a extreme statement, but you know, songs are extreme statements. <laughs> songs are a distilled emotion. So in the studio, I wanted to use wine glasses to make notes, obviously. And I actually took a wine bottle and I poured into a bunch of different wine glasses and poured out and poured more until it was the right notes. And I actually used wine that is intimately connected to the person that the song was about. So I won't say what kind it was. So I recommend listening to it by candlelight, maybe with a glass of wine, maybe not. Whatever feels good and is healthy for you. Can't wait for you to hear it.